one thing we're not special on is our correction system because you cannot keep putting money into that system. And you know what, I, I finally uh, analogized it to somebody. I said, with all this stuff we've done about minimum sentence and everything, it's like gill netting. And that is, we run a net across the river. And if we all believe, and I do believe the statistics, that 80% of the crime is committed by 20% of the people. With our gill net, are we picking up some of those 20 and giving them long sentences that makes us safer? Yes. But who else are we picking up in the gill net? That's the problem. But what I want to do is that I want to try and take all of this research, which PSU and a number of institutions here do on the, the uh, criminal justice sentencing policy. But if you look at it over the last 20, 25 years, the public has gone in the exact opposite direction that all the academics have said, this is what you guys should be looking at. How do you take good evidence-based research and said this is good public policy and how do you implement it in a political process?